uh, the soul, okay, which is the uh, the nafs. These are created by Allah. What Allah is, we don't know. Okay, you as a Christian, you believe is a spirit. I'm asking you this very simple question: Did Jesus speak ever or not? What do you mean his his flesh is speaking? Are you saying he doesn't have the ability to speak? In order to speak, do you need your consciousness? Do you need a spirit? Of course, without the spirit, you can't speak. So everything Jesus is speaking is his spirit, not his flesh. His flesh can do zilch. Yes, because his flesh is nothing without him as a spirit. And Jesus says, everything I speak, I've been commanded by the Father. I've been commanded by God. Everything Jesus speaks is commanded by God. You know when Jesus says, your sins are forgiven? That is exactly what he's saying. Because everything he says has been commanded to say by the Father. Yeah, yeah. So his Father told him what to say. He never speaks of his own. Neither does the Holy Spirit, which is actually spirit, you know. That's a conundrum in your, in your logic now. I don't know how you're going to get out of that one. It says about in John 16, 14, that the Holy Spirit, which you believe, the, uh, the, the paraclete to come, Jesus says, I cannot tell you everything, but he, the spirit of truth, will come and lead you into all truth. Yeah. You believe that's the Holy Spirit, am I right? Yeah. Yes? Yeah. Good. It says a uh, spirit will not speak of his own. He will only say what he hears. From whom? Again, God the Father. Yes? Excuse me. Hold on a minute. I can't believe I'm a grown, highly educated man. You are over six feet tall and you're so stupid. <laughs> No, 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 no. Me, Have respect for him. Come you're on, telling me somebody named Jesus. Can I speak? Was it a human being? Jesus was a human being? God is a spirit. Ah? Huh? God is a spirit. Uh huh. God in flesh. God in flesh. What does that make sense to you, anyone? Then how, <laughs> if, if Jesus was God, how come ordinary human beings kill him? Exactly. But he's saying, he keeps saying he's a spirit. He doesn't distinguish that the person is attached to a spirit and a body. He doesn't distinguish that. You cannot kill him. But you, 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 you say Jesus as God. You could kill flesh. I don't think he's read the Bible, this guy. You say Jesus is God, yet man kill God. Let me, let me put something you, you here. Let me put, sa let me put something here. He understands quite well. Religion never came to this country until the 17th century. The 17th century. In 1555, the English threatened to each other as cannibals. They were cannibals. This is a cemetery. This used to be a cemetery. Oh, yeah? yeah. It's when they heard about the empire of Ghana. Ghana is the center of the earth. The time of day starts at Ghana. No one talk about it. The history of the Bible is about the people living in North Africa. All the countries from Syria to South Africa, that's Africa. Okay? Okay, we're getting away from the topic. No, 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 we're not getting away from We're talking about Jesus dying. All of this thing about Jesus Christ. Yeah. All right. Your body, stop it now. Your body, if you die, your head and your bones will last for 2,000 years on the ground. Your, head, your skull won't rot. Jesus died. They can't find no bones from his body. They can't find his head or nothing, no bones or nothing. Yeah? That, um, so how the could he be a human being? Sorry, the flesh is? He's saying that it's not a person that's going to die. Yeah. It's the same for us. That's what I'm telling you. Yeah. yeah. I think he's a kid. He doesn't understand. So, so what are God is we got to we got to teach him slowly. So does that mean that we're God? You're just yeah. born. You don't, you don't know anything about it. You have to, you don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? He keeps saying God is the spirit. God is the spirit. I don't know how you get to know English history. You find out they built a false god called Jesus Christ. It was on the people. They used to control people. That's how they colonized the world. Don't get some education. Huh? No, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. I don't think so, at least. Jesus is white. Hey, come on, come on, guys. God is jet black. Jesus is a white man. <laughs> Stop it. OK. So anyway, going back to our discussion. Black. Was the nitrates of the of the world 
keep the world going, that's all the air of them to live fast. Night trade. I'm pretty sure the snow is not uh, black, but anyway, carry on. What I'm saying is this if Jesus, I said the snow is not black, he said everything is black. Just a, just a side comment. Let me ask you this. You, also, you keep saying Jesus is a spirit. Jesus is a spirit. Was he ever flesh? Can the spirit ever die? Now, so somebody died on the cross. Who died? You keep saying it wasn't Jesus who died. So who died on the cross? Who's flesh? Good. So Jesus did not die. Good. The Father did not die, Jesus did not die, the Holy Spirit did not die. So nobody died on the cross except somebody who is not God. No, he took upon our sins and on, the, and, and on the cross our sins were crucified. The sins were crucified. Seriously? Do you understand what I mean? Did someone die on the cross? Who died on the cross? Who died on the cross? Okay, anyway, I was talking to him. So back to him. Who you said you said somebody died on the cross. Who is this? Because the flesh is not somebody. The flesh belongs to somebody. <laughs> so so did the flesh of God die? It gets even more It gets even more weird, isn't it? The the flesh that God became. The word became flesh, remember? Do you actually not agree with the Bible was the word became flesh? So why do you keep why do you keep opposing it? Say it, say it, the word became flesh. Say it loudly so I can hear it. Do you agree with that? Do you agree with that? Okay. Is the word God? Because you some you somehow disagree. Even though I've repeated this several times. What? Jesus. Yes. God is a spirit. What is spirit? God is a spirit. Let him finish. Let him finish. Yeah. God is a spirit. Carry on. God is a spirit. <coughs> what spirit is God? The Holy Spirit. That's what God. Is. Also, you're telling me. Okay. Is the Father a spirit? The Father is he a spirit? Is the Father and the Holy Spirit the same entity? Yes. Are you sure? Same thing. Okay. So why does the Holy Spirit say? Sorry, what does God say that the Holy Spirit will not speak of its own? Because it won't. God will speak. You but you told me they are the same. Make up your mind. You told me the Holy Spirit and God the Father are the same. Oh dear. So who is God the Father then? God. What do you mean God the Father? God. Don't say Father, just say God. Because Jesus say calls God. him the Father. No, just say God. Are you denying what Jesus no, addresses him? Just say God. Why you don't want me to say the Father? Because I know I know how your mind works. Where is the Father God? Saying, Do you know how Jesus' mind works? God, no, 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 no. Listen, 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 listen. I didn't use the word Trinity. I'm saying the way words that Jesus uses. Jesus says, I go to my Father. Does he mean I'm going to the Holy Spirit? Answer. He's going to spirit. No, is he going to the Father or the Holy Spirit? I know. Thank you. Is he going to the Father or the Holy Spirit? Which part of that you don't understand? It's simple English, my friend. <laughs> but he says, I'm going to the Father. No, he said, I'm going to the Father. So you are rejecting what Jesus says and you're inputting your own words into the Bible. No, the, in, jo in John 20, 17, God. he says, <coughs> you know why? Because the next statement proves what I'm saying. In John 20, 17, Jesus says, I go to my father and your father, my God, my God and your God. Exactly. So Jesus <coughs> is saying he's going to the father. Exactly. So the Father is Spirit and the Holy Spirit is Spirit. Are they both the same? <laughs> Are the Holy Spirit and God the Father the same? Holy Spirit is God. And what about the Father? <laughs> gotcha, huh? Gotcha. No, you played yourself. I didn't play myself. That's what the Bible says. No, I said. You said the Father after I said the Spirit. Okay, let me I never said the Father. You know why you want to play the Spirit game? 
Because according to you, all three. No, no, no. I know, I know your game. You can kick, you can smile from year to year, but I can still get your, the point you're trying to make. The reason you're reluctant to say the father is because you are going to be completely contradicting yourself. You know why? Because here's the thing. Did the father die on the cross? I agree. Did the father die on the cross? Define death. Define die. Define death. Do you mind? Step aside. I'm talking to him. Define death. Yeah. Join, join the queue. I might take you next. Are you guys brothers? Define death. I will. I will. But I'm, I'm not going to answer your question. You've asked your question. I'm going to answer, well, I'm going to answer yours. Oh yeah. Well, but he asked you first. Exactly. Regardless, I'm not. I'm not obliged to answer him. <laughs> Listen to this. Did the father die on the cross? God can't die. I know God can't die. Look, God cannot die. We, we got that out of the way. Now the next question. Did the father die? Did the, did the father die on the cross? God cannot die. I agree. Let's move on. Let's move on. Can God... I know, I know, I know. You know what? I know. He's playing. He's playing. He's playing. He's playing. Oh, so I'm playing. According to him, I'm playing. But in the Bible, you have the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Yes. You. Have, I didn't say the Trinity. I didn't say the Trinity. In the Bible, you have the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Do you or not? So why in the Quran? Do you or not? Jesus said. Jesus said very clearly that I go to my God. Which God is that? Which God? Get away, Peter. Which God is that? Okay, Which God is that? Guys, guys, don't answer him. We are done with this dickies or this is here or whatever they call themselves. Listen to this. Jesus says, I go to my God. Which God is that? Spirit. Okay. Was Jesus, was Jesus, is Jesus God? If you don't want to prophesy, you don't take care Does he have a God? No, does he have a God? So Jesus lied when he says, I go to my God. Because you're standing next to him. We're backing him now. So is that spirit is God? So am I, and I'm moved to come up to speak now. Okay, should we ask you the question? I'm trying to speak Okay, we can I go to my God and your God. And before that? So he's saying he knows that human beings are looking at his flesh. So he says, I'm going to my God and to your God also. So who is Jesus' so God then? Spirit, okay, he, he's, he's going back to spirit. spirit. Okay, is that spirit, is that, sorry now friend, is that spirit to whom Jesus is going, is that the God of Jesus? That's the reference. Say again? Is that spirit the God of Jesus? What's your problem man, can you understand? You, you want me on camera, don't worry. Stand here. No, no, stand here, stand here. No, stand here. Because you have a problem hearing or understanding, I don't know, or both maybe. Well, tell them they're Christian, you're Christian brothers. Oh, he doesn't want to answer any of your questions, Peter. Peter, he doesn't want to answer any of your questions. So basically, the question I'm asking him is that, does Jesus have a God? He said Allah and the Messiah. Who's your, who's your I Lord? I asked you, I didn't who's ask you. Lord? Peter, I'm not talking to you. Why? Can we talk? What's your name, by the way? What's your name? David? Okay, David, just ignore those guys because you're already getting confused with this very simple analogy that I'm giving you. No, I'm telling you, I'm telling you that Jesus, Jesus says, I go to my God. Now you're saying that God is a spirit, right? That's fine. Does Jesus have a God which is a spirit? Yes. Okay, so Jesus is God. I got that. Does, does this God, which is Jesus, have a God? Does that God, Jesus, have a God? Do you want to read it? Jesus is God. I know. Does he have a God? Does he have a God? Jesus is God. Are you, are you some, are you thick or what? You don't understand this simple question. Well, if you ask him like 16 times the same question. No, no, no. Okay. No, no. You say, Jesus himself says, I go to my God. I'm asking the question. Jesus. All right, all right. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Jesus is example. He didn't give an example. No, no, no. He said, he said, I go to my God and your God. That means the God of the Israelites 
And his God is the same. He said that that's a good answer. He's Jesus. Jesus. Is, that, is, that, is that disturbing? Jesus. Am I speaking directly to him? Does he have a God? Does he have a God? Okay. Does this God, which is God, have a God? Okay, Jesus is a God. Does he have a God now? He doesn't have to say no. Is no, but he, he he's deliberately evading it. It doesn't matter. He said, it's, it's okay, good. No. Not being a God, he's saying no. Thank you, I agree with you. So basically, I'll go with Jesus' words, not your words. Jesus claims he has a God. Okay? Now, we know that God Almighty cannot have a God. The fact that Jesus has a God, this proves him to be a God. Okay? The only people who believe that are stupid, actually. The only people who believe that God is a God is stupid. Because they themselves do not understand. Forget about flesh. Every person who has flesh is mortal. And Jesus was a mortal. Okay? I'm talking to everyone, not all of you. We're not very special. Jesus was here before Doesn't matter. You keep saying flesh as a flesh stands by itself. Jesus was here before his flesh stands. Jesus was here before Abraham. Do you understand that? Can you understand that? Can I answer? Can I answer? Okay. Jesus, you're saying was here before his flesh was here. Before Abraham. Good, good. Is that Jesus, the Father? Some see, <laughs> see, you can't answer that. Because when you say father, the reason he doesn't want to answer. No, no, no. When you say father, yeah, that, that, that's implying that he, has, that he has a son. Okay, so when Jesus, so when, good, 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 good. So when when he says, when, it implies that he has a son. I agree with you. Is Jesus the Son of God? Is Jesus the Son of God? His flesh, yeah. What do you mean? His flesh. You're saying the flesh is the son of God? You are all sons of God. His flesh is. Are you saying the flesh is the son of God? What kind of a Christian is this guy? are all sons of God and die like Ah, no, no, I'm not a son of God. I'm a son of Adam. His flesh is son of God. Okay, good. So who's the father then? flesh is son of God. So when Jesus says, my father, who's that? Is that Allah? Spirit. Which spirit? spirit? Holy Spirit? Is that the Holy Spirit? Holy Spirit. Oh, that's the Holy Spirit. So the Holy Spirit is the Father. I think this guy has to learn his Christianity. I think I'm done with him now. As soon as... as soon as, 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 as I'll speak to you. No problem. Okay, come, come, come here. 